Um, I think I've been he hearing a call to ordain ministry, and I just wanted to, to um, discern the, that call and listen to some great speakers like Bishop Jane Allen Middleton. This weekend I'm here because I've been experiencing a call to what I feel presently is to be an ordained elder in the United Methodist Church. I'm here because I came without any youth and I came because I was hoping to uh, discover a little more about my own call. I mainly came here because my youth leader actually brought it up to one of my friends and I and we've been to a couple of retreats before with my youth group and um, you know I kind of thought you know the fellowship seeing other Christians my age would be kind of nice and I came really not knowing what to expect. I actually just came because my youth leader asked us and uh, I thought I could learn something and maybe benefit from something else. Um, I've been coming since the first year. Um, basically, I have felt God calling me into ordained ministry and each year it kind of helps me along a little more in my journey. I enjoy spending time with others here as well as um, finding out maybe more specifically what God wants me to do in my life and um, I feel I sense that he is calling me to become a missionary um, possibly in the Middle East I'm not sure uh. every year I've come I the, my purpose for what I wanted to do has changed um, my first year I wanted to be um, a psychologist um, and then my second year I changed into youth ministry and I was really passionate about that and then last year um, I went to a seminar on ordained ministry and um, I felt God calling me into that. And this is kind of like an encouraging event uh, to come here and see other people going through the process, to hear some of their problems, some of their frustrations. You know, so you come here and you're just immersed with a, an environment of other people struggling and toiling and it just makes you feel good because you know you're not alone going through it. So I like to meet all the people, especially like the pastors, because they're real people. <laughs> and that's so relaxing to me. I feel like I'm at home here. I'm around other people that are, you know, going to do the same thing.